guys, welcome. This is The Buzz. I mean, this is first episode of season three, showing for the very first time on UK TV. And guys in Africa, hello once again. This is definitely your favorite TV show. We're feeling the love from the West, not East of Africa. Absolutely. Man, and now we're giving love back. That's right, that's right. And you know what? This season, oh my God, we are so packed with new amazing things, such as new segments, including Fashion Connect, New Music Countdown. Definitely. Oh, and many, many more. And yeah, we'll bring you the hot news from Africa, just the way it is. Absolutely. Guys, without further ado, we're going straight into it. Right now, you are watching The Buzz. Remember, The Buzz, this is not a bumble bill. This is the real buzz. Laughter is the best medicine. I'm your local pharmacist. So, guys, come with me. Andy, um, so P-Square. Yeah. Okay, I, I know it sounds like I'm gossiping, but everybody knows this already, but I still want to be confirmed. Glow is dropping them. Yeah, that's a, that's a big setback. Yeah. That is such. I mean, like, I, I get it. But Glow is saying that they need to drop them simply because they've um, they're now trying talking about splitting the, the two boys that make up the square of the P. I like that. Um, so Glow is saying that we were they they paid or the, the ambassador were the two of them together as a unit and not separately. Yeah, they're definitely a fan. A true fan would not want to see P Square break up, man. They're, very successful as a group, oh so God. we want to keep them together. Mm. And talking about bad news, man, the Paco Master has just survived an accident. I mean, um, Mr. Terry G, so well, I mean, we're glad he's alive, man. Absolutely, up, man? absolutely. Get so, well soon. All these things happening in music, but you have a, a, a oh, yeah, thing talking to drop. about music, man. Yemi Alade was in town and she also paid us a visit, man. Absolutely. She's dropping one of the most anticipated albums this year. Ooh. Looking forward to that, man. You know, she's killing it. That sister is. An exclusive album listening party for Johnny hit singer Yemi Alade took place a few nights ago in London. This album entitled Mama Africa, The Diary of an African Woman, is set to take the music world by storm upon release in March 2016. The listening party, which took place at the Tunnel in central London, was Yemi's first album listening party in London. You get to know one on one. Um, it's like a, how I put it. It's like a close group study. Mm. It's the it's a, it's a careful selection of people from different um, of different ages, from different works, etc. Yeah. You get to see their reaction to certain types of songs. You see sometimes you see the older people moving to um, the slow, calmer songs, and the younger people are ready for yeah, all the big, upbeat big, big, big. songs. <laughs> yeah. But sometimes there are these songs that cut across all the types. Now you need to be able to watch out and. Find those ones. The album is set to feature the biggest names in the African music scene. In attendance were several celebs such as Malik Berry, Dill, Smade, Chicane, Runtown, and many more. Excuse me, I'm just staring. That girl is beautiful. And Definitely. you know, she did that album cover without makeup on. Oh. She is stunning. She's a true symbol of an African woman. Man, man. what was it like strong. that day? I mean, it was crazy though. I met loads of people. And I must tell the fans that anyone that's anyone in the African music scene is on this album. So it is very interesting and it's special. Wow, absolutely special. Man, I, I gotta get off her. Um, let's move on. Let's talk about Fred Amata. Oh my God, the gentleman has got himself a new position. Check this out. Fred Amata of the Amata dynasty has emerged the winner of the keenly contested president of the Directors Guild of Nigeria, DGN. The prolific actor cum director was declared the president-elect of the guild after beating his close rival, Lancelot Emerson, with five votes to emerge the winner of the election. He got 48 votes, while Lancelot got 43 votes. Ecstatic supporters were thrilled as soon as Fred was declared the winner of the election. Fred is to succeed Andy Amenichi, who resigned as the president. I'm really proud of Fred. I think I he will make a great leader. Absolutely. As a pioneer of, of African movies, yeah. you know, especially, I, I think he deserves it. Definitely, man. I wonder what his ex will be thinking, Ibinabo. Man, she'll be thinking, hmm, I'll be a good first lady or something. You know, I think she's a great leader as well. She did very well when she was a president. I know she did. I know she and, did. Um, but why are you bringing her in anyway? We're not talking about her. We're talking about Fred. Because uh, secretly, I think I'm sad that they broke and up. The, you know, I would love to see them together. Are you carrying a touch They're for her leaders. as well? Yeah, man. She paid me loads of money to take care of this beast. So I need to get her back into the picture. Fred, man, get back with you being a ball, man. All right, guys, we're now going to something new for you, yeah. man. In case you missed it, you want to know what's this all about? 
Well, while we were on a break, we had to cover events just for you. That's right. So we covered AY Life. That's right. And this was for you. That was really great. And you heard that AY just got a new London management? Yes. Yeah, man, that's very interesting. Absolutely, so. which means that AY is going to be more in London and we get to see more of him and we get to bring more of him to you from London. Yeah, definitely. How old do you think AY is? Oh, God. Yeah. Don't ask. He's always dressing like a 19 year old. But I it's know. All, I'm feeling him. The boy is dapper, though. Yo, dapper, dapper. The boy is dapper. Screen, but yes, guys, <laughs> just in case you missed it, here's AY Live. Catch up. It's AY. It doesn't get bigger than him. It's my first time, and I know that he always has a sellout program in Nigeria. So I'm excited to be here, and I'm looking forward to a fantastic night. Welcome, this is the AY Live Show. We are here, we are excited. It is going to be epic. Listen, we've been waiting for this show since September. And finally, it is here. Excitement, check out the lineup. We have AY, the man himself. You have Helen Paul, you have Agodai, you have God. Oh my God, should I carry on? There's Gordons. And of course, tonight's musical entertainment that we're all waiting for, Flavor Nabania. What can be better? Guys, we are going to go in and check them out. We'll see you on the other side. So stay tuned. I can't enter play. Is the money asking, what would you like to eat, please? Yeah, yeah. I tell them, what do you have? So, okay, there's some meal. Check the meal. I said, I beg you not get a Thank you. Everybody give your wife your phone now. Huh? Give your wife your phone. Make sure you put your lock. Hi, I'm Akino Akiemi. I'm here for the AY show and I think this place is bubbling. I hope it's going to be a great show. I've been to quite a lot of shows in the country, but this one, I hope it's going to be a great one. Since I've been coming to this land, I've seen a lot of expensive cars, but I'm yet to see the most expensive car in the world in London. I'm not talking about the Cadillac or the Rolls Royce or the Range Rover Sport or the Vosor. I'm not talking about any of that. Not even the best X500. I'm not talking about or the Ferrari or the Lamborghini. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the most expensive car in this world. That car is so equipped to have a TM machine in it. I'm looking forward to a fabulous evening, a great night. Looking to be entertained, to be thrilled. And um, to have a wonderful time, really. It's great to come out here to support the guys. What is it? What? Now, what do you pay me this? So, the next time with an off light, everybody on touch. Because we only need a track like this. Say, 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 I need a track. Wait, what? Don't go to punch. Okay, do. I want to marry you. That's that song. Do you okay. know that song? My mother will be the hill. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> how are you? I'm good, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. So, organizing this and everything, it takes a huge, huge effort. Yeah, it's the AY show, is the fifth edition in the UK. We handle media. The fifth? Yeah, fifth edition, and um, it just shows how far we've gone in the UK as a diaspora community. Entertaining, creating our own entertainment for our own people. And it's, um, the buzz is good. And how do you manage to get all these acts together in one place? You know, like I'm talking about schedules, everybody's busy doing their own thing. But well, you manage to get them under one roof. It's very compartmentalized. Um, it's an AY show, so AY deals with a lot, pretty much a lot of the handling of the artists. We are on the UK side doing different things to make it happen. So there are people doing media, there are people doing production, there are people doing um, all the other elements of the event yeah. that most people don't see out there. So really the kudos goes to quite a huge team to make this successful. Absolutely. So tonight, have you been to any of AY shows before? No. This is your first time? Yeah. Okay. Flavor is also coming to this show, and we know Flavor and uh, Miss Nigerias and Miss Anything Beauty. So that's all I have to say. I'm not gonna lie to you. 